What is up, guys? Mr. The Reverts here. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we have lost yet another soldier in the line of duty versus Activision and the Warzone Battle Royale market. Um, a couple weeks ago, the Gaming Revolution lost his Twitter account because he was the main source of information for Warzone Battle Royale leaks. And now Activision has sent Reddit a subpoena to have the identity of the user who leaked the Warzone Battle Royale poster. And Reddit more than likely will just give up that person's identity soon to avoid legal issues so whoever that is i'm pretty sure they're gonna have the entire book thrown at them the person who sent them that image is gonna get sued and yeah they're just gonna go down the line until they find out whoever the employee was at activision or wherever that source was from and i think this move is definitely very very scary because activision is putting it out there hey if you're gonna be releasing any of our content to the public before we do then just be prepared to have the entire book thrown at you and this also goes for data miners or heck like we saw with the gaming revolution and other content creators if you even report or repost anything regarding leaks then they are going to be taking that very very seriously so i am predicting that in regards to future leaks i think this event is definitely going to change the direction of how websites and us youtubers report information like this now in regards to how i'm going to be moving forward when i make videos about leaks and information because that's one of the top Topics I do discuss here on the channel along with tips and commentaries if Charlie Intel reports it then so will I because they are the biggest source for Call of Duty information so again if they're gonna be reporting on it then I will too and now apparently Warzone is set to release in March according to VGC news and the exact release date on it is Tuesday March the 10th but again this information is not confirmed it's just purely from their inside source and also that the battle royale mode has been co-developed by Raven Software and Infinity Ward and also the game is going to be free to play which is absolutely amazing to hear and very very good for the Call of Duty franchise um, so yeah that's just a little bit of information that we know about Warzone and the release date and then also there's been reports that there is going to be a event for YouTubers and other media personnel coming out sometime within this week or next week so um, it just seems like Warzone Battle Royale is definitely on the horizon and it's for sure going to be a solid thing. It's definitely set in stone because um, Activision has even, you know, taken down the images of the Warzone Battle Royale poster. And, uh, of course, we saw with the Gaming Revolution, again, they took down some of his leaks and his own Twitter account even. So um, it's for sure a thing. And we're going to be getting that information coming out very, very soon here. I do predict within the next couple of days here or weeks, we are going to be getting like a little teaser trailer and uh, little hints and clues here and there about the event so um, again it's just on the horizon guys I'm very very excited this does give me uh, more motivation to play Modern Warfare because you guys know I'm a huge Battle Royale fan um, absolutely love Blackout Battle Royale but the main thing that kind of caused it to not really take off as well as I thought it would is because the game wasn't free to play but Warzone is actually going to be free to play according to the leaks so if that's the case then I definitely do see this Battle Royale taking off um, like Apex and maybe even Fortnite. So um, the possibilities are definitely there. It's just a matter of if Activision and Infinity Ward plus Raven Software do market the game well. And, uh, you know, it's just a solid flowing game. So I'm very, very excited, guys. Please tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments. I love you all so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.